Welcome to episode 850 of Apartment Hacker. This is Mike Burnett, Apartment Hacker. is my mission to tease out human potential in the multifamily space. So today I wanted to talk about why the downside of adversity is so important and why when things happen to you in your life that, that you don't like or that were unplanned or that have given cause for adversity in your life, those are the moments that grow you the most. Those are the moments that have been sent your way to teach a lesson or to bring you around to a different way of thinking. And to the extent that you embrace those, that you make a choice, that that choice that you get to make between catalyst, that thing that's happening to you, and the response that you that you give to it, um, that's an important moment. And in times of adversity, it's very hard. Uh, to sit back and think, wow, this thing is happening to me for a good reason. Um, <laughs> it's probably the furthest thing from your mind, but it is likely one of the most important, or those moments in time are the most important moments in time for you. And they are a challenge to your ability to make a good choice uh, in terms of embracing it for the lesson that it is trying to teach you. Um, but it is also important that you do make that choice and that you do embrace it for all the, that you will become because of making a choice to embrace the adversity in your life. So whatever you might be facing today, this week, this month, this year, embrace it. If, especially if it's on the downside of adversity, embrace that moment. Uh, try to tease out those things that that lesson is trying to teach you, that, that that adversity, that event, that experience is trying to teach you. Bounce it off of others. Uh, really tear it apart, really try to understand it. And once you do make application of what it is that you were taught, um, maybe you're trying to give up some sort of addiction in your life, right? And that addiction has caused some adversity in your life. And some that, that adversity is really trying to teach you that that addiction is not healthy for you. Um, and that you need to seek outside help or you need to seek uh, friends, family, whatever. Go out and seek the help that you need, tear that thing apart, understand it for what it is, and understand the root causes of it, and then make application of a new behavior in your life. Now, I'm under no illusion that those types of things are easy. They're not easy. I've I've faced down my own addictions, and they're, <clears throat> it's the hardest work you'll ever do in your life, but it is the most important work that you'll ever do in your life. So as you move yourself into 2020, consider that the downside of any adversity that you've experienced in 2019 happened for a reason. And it happened for a reason that is giving cause for you to tear it apart, dig into it, and understand it for what it is, and make application of a new behavior in your life so that 2020 is a more prosperous year for you. Take care. We'll talk to you again soon.